investigators make a startling discovery. A seemingly harmless action meant to increase comfort on the plane may have led to disaster. While American Eagle Flight 4184 was holding, Captain Orlando Aguiar notices that the nose is tipped quite high. Captain Aguiar knows that the plane's high nose angle was producing an uncomfortable tilt in the passenger cabin. Extending the flaps would have the effect of lowering the plane's nose, making the ride more comfortable. When investigators duplicated this maneuver, they found that it had a dramatic effect on where the ice ridge formed on the plane's wing. The flaps made the icing problem even worse. By exposing more of the upper surface of the wing to the oncoming water droplets, and that's one of the reasons why we got um, the ridge of ice where we got it was because of the flaps 15 configuration. The crew of Flight 4184 is unaware that a ridge of ice more than a centimeter high has built up on the surface of their wings. The ice buildup has no effect on the flight until First Officer Gagliano begins his descent to 8,000 feet. This triggers a warning from the flight computer telling the crew they're flying too fast with the flaps extended. Gagliano now retracts the flaps, but the routine gesture has a dramatic effect on the plane's aerodynamics. When they retracted the flaps as they started their descent down to 8,000 feet, the airplane pitched back up into a very nose-high attitude created the turbulence that pulled up the ailerons, sending the plane into a roll, stalled and tumbled from the sky. Had this crew had about two to 3,000 more feet of altitude, there's a high probability that they would have been able to salvage or recover the airplane before it struck the ground.